Hi, my name is Samantha, and I'm playing the Tin Man. Hi, my name is Paige, and I play the role of Glinda. I am Kelly Holtus, and I'm playing the Wizard of Oz. I am Coco Scoma, and I'm playing a tree and an Ozian. I'm Ben Hazel, and I am playing a crow and Uncle Henry. I am Christine, and I am playing Auntie M and an Ozian. I'm Anna, I'm playing Hickory the Farmhand and Bo the Crow. I'm Reed Krebs, and I play Hunk and a Crow. I'm Barrett Keller, and I play a farmhand named Zeke and a monkey. I am Nico Behar, and I play Professor Marvel and a Crow. I'm Ryan Keller, and I play the judge of Munchkin City and a flying monkey. I'm Brody Layson, and I'm, uh, and I'm a Winky and a Munchkin band. I'm Grayson Lachon, and I'm a Munchkin, an Ozzet, and a Jitterbug. Hi, I'm David. I play Thorn the Monkey. Hi, I'm Brody Goodman, and I play an Ozzy and a Munchkin. Hi, I'm Alex Mars, and I play Captain Beardo, and I'm the mayor of Munchkin Land. Hi, my name is Talia Barella. I play a Munchkin, and the Oz at Diamond, and a Jitterbug. My name is Elsa Archbold, and I play a Munchkin and a Poppy. My name is Lexi Barella, and I play a Munchkin and a Poppy. My name is Juliet Cool, and I play a Munchkin and a Poppy. I'm Annalise Peppers, and I play the Wicked Witch of the West. I'm Luciana and I play um, um, Violet. I'm Ryan McAuliffe and I play the corner and the monkeys who work for the Wicked Witch. I'm Charlotte and I play Mayor's wife, Ozian, and Jitterbag. My name is Zach and I play a Winky. In, um, in Munchkin Band. My name is Max, and I'm in. The, I'm a Winky and in the Munchkin Band. My name is Will, and I'm the, in the Munchkin Band. Hi, my name is Ruby, and I'm a Poppy. Hi, my name is Sierra, and I'm Miss Gulch and a um, Flying Monkey. Hi, my name is Isadora, and I play the Barrister and the Poppy Queen. Hi, my name is Ava, and I play Oz Dorothy. Hi, my name is Jake, and I play Winky. Hi, my name is Inez, and I play a Nazette and a Munchkin and a Jitterbug Queen. Hi, I'm Ryan Letso, and I play the Cowardly Lion. My name is Tomas, and I'm a Monkey and a Munchkin. Well, my name is Presley, and I play a Ozian and a Munchkin. My name is Sienna, and I play Sunflower. Hi, I'm Daphne Doom, and I play Dorothy. Hi, I'm Lily Smith, and I play Scarecrow. I'm Manoa, and I am part of Tech Crew. I'm Hayden Gallo, and I'm Tech Crew as well. I am Sophia, and I am part of prop directing. Get the pigs into the barn, Hunk. Turn up the scales. Zeke, what am I going to do 
about Miss Fultz. Look here, Dorothy. Now look here, Dorothy. You're not using your head about her. You act like you don't have a brain. I have so got brains. Well, then you just gotta use them, honey. No, just don't go by Miss Gulch's place, and Toto won't get into her garden, and you won't get into any trouble. That's right. That way, Toto won't bump into her old cat, and Miss Gulch won't be having a heart attack again. Oh, Hickory, Toto would chase that cat no matter what I do. Well, you've got a point there. I reckon chasing cats is what dogs do. Or you can let that old ghost try and buffalo you. She ain't nothing to be afraid of. Toto occurs, that's all, honey. Not afraid of her, Zeke. Well, that's just fine. Come on, now, we got to feed those pigs before the weather turns. Let's get a move on. Auntie Umbrella, you know what Miss Gold said she was going to do to Toto? Dorothy, stop imagining things. But she said she was going to take him away. Now, you just help us out today and go find yourself a place where you won't get into any trouble. A place where there isn't any trouble. Do you suppose there is such a place, Toto? It's not a place that you can get to by a boat or a train. It's far, far away, beyond the moon, beyond the rain. That's where Done. What she done? I'm all but lame for the bite on my leg. You mean she bit you? No, her dog. Oh, she bit her dog, eh? No, that dog's a menace to the community. Toto is really friendly f with friendly people, that is. I'm taking him to the sheriff and making sure he's destroyed. Destroyed? Destroyed? Toto, you can't. You mustn't. Well, that's for the sheriff to decide. Really, Miss Gulch, Dorothy won't go by your place. Will that take care of it? Emily Gale, I don't think you're listening to me. How would it be if she keeps him tied up? If you don't hand that dog over, I'll sue you and take your whole farm. <gasps> Gracious me! There's a law protecting folks against dogs that bite. They're there, Miss Gulch. It's not good. Dramatic! Well, I won't have him attack me again. No, I won't let you take him. You go away or I'll bite you myself. Why, I'm perfectly shocked. Such disrespect. Dorothy! Here, give that dog to me. I've got the paper from the sheriff. The sheriff? Well, we can't go against the law. Oh, you wicked old witch. Child, go to the house now. Auntie, I'm Uncle Henry. Please don't let her take him. Please stop her. Oh, Henry, the idea. Elmira Gulch. Just because you own half of the county doesn't give you the right to run the rest of us. For 23 years, I've been wanting to tell you what I think of you, and now being a Christian woman, well, I just won't say it. <laughs> Looks like she really told you all. Here you go, you Got what we came for now. Get your carcass off my land. Why, Henry Gale, how dare you? Dropping by for dinner, are you? Now, who might you be? Hmm, don't tell me, let's see. You're traveling in the skies? Nope, 
that's not right. You're going on a visit? Nope, that's wrong. You're running away. How did you guess? Professor Marvel never guesses. Now, why might you be running away? They don't appreciate you at home. They don't understand you. You want to see the big cities, big mountains, big oceans? Why, it's just like you can read my mind. Please, Professor, can we go with you? Why, I never do anything without consulting the heavenly spheres. Now, close your eyes. I see a house with a picket fence and a barn. That's our farm. I see a woman wearing an apron. That's Auntie M. Her name is Emily. That's right, what's she doing? Why, she's crying. It looks as if someone has just about broken her heart. Oh, I've got to get back to her right away. Thank you, Professor Marvel. Take care of yourself, child. Look at that sky. Storms are coming. Verify it legally. To see, to see if 
she, if she is morally, ethically, spiritually, physically, absolutely, undeniably, and reliably dead. No, I'm afraid I 
to these apples. Picky, picky, picky. Will you stop that whining? She's gone to the birds. Come along, Dorothy. You don't want any of those apples anyway. Are you saying my apples are what they ought to be? Are you calling our apples rotten? Oh, no. It's just that she doesn't like little green worms. Green worms? That's the last straw. Take this. And that. How do you like them apples? Look, Dorothy. Help yourself. Look, robot. Why, look, it's a man. A man made out of tin. <clears throat> Did you say something? <clears throat> he said oil can. Wait, that? 
That's too bad. Don't you think the wizard could help him too? I don't see why not. Why don't you come along with us? Wouldn't you feel degraded to be seen in the company of a cowardly lion? I would. Of course not. I'm sure the wizard would give you courage. Gee, that's awfully nice of you. My life has been simply unbearable. Life is sad, believe me, missy. When you're born to be a sissy without the vim and voice. But I can show my prowess, be a lion, not a mouse, if I only had the knife. I'm afraid there's no denying, I'm just a dandelion, a fate I don't deserve. <laughs> but I could change my habits, never more be scared of rabbits, if I only had the knife.
notice? What notice? It's on the door as plain as the nose on my face. Oh, um, there we go. Bell out of order. Please knock. Well, that's more like it. Now state your business. We want to see the wizard. No one can see the wizard. No one's ever seen the wizard. Well, how do you know there is one? Because, though you're wasting my time. Please, sir, the good witch of the North sent us. Prove it. She's wearing her ruby slipper. Well, bust my buttons. That's a horse of a different color. Come on in. Look, a lion! A huge lion! No lions allowed. Call off the guard. Stay away from us, you brute. Scott, Scott. Take it easy, take it easy. That hurt my feelings. Why, stop that, please. He looks fierce, but he's really just a big kitten. Oh, I'm sorry. Look, he's purring. Why, so he is. A kitten indeed. He's adorable. Aw, oh, shucks. Welcome to Oz. There's a garden spot I'm told where it's never too hot and you're never too cold. Where you're never too young and you're never too old. And where you're never too thin or tall. And you're never, never, never too, too anything at all. You're never too bad and you're never too same. And you don't compare and you don't compare. Rhinoceros? Preposterous! Not even a hippopotamus? I'd drag him from top to bottomless. Supposing me an elephant, I'd wrap him up in elephant. What if it were a brontosaurus? I'd show Moose King of the Forest. How? Courage! 
What makes the hot and pot so hot? What puts the ape in apricot? What have they got that I ain't got? Courage! You can say that again. Courage. <laughs> Monkeys, we have two words for the primates. Surrender, Dorothy! Dorothy? Wizard now? The wizard says, go away! Scat! Oh my. Did, did I do that? I was so happy and Aunty was so good to me and I never appreciated it. <laughs> oh, please don't cry. I'll get you to the wizard somehow. Oh, just please don't cry. I had an Auntie on myself once. <laughs> Or a 
a critter in the trees. It's giving me the jitters and the joints around my knees. I think I see a shadow, but she's fuzzy and she's furry. I haven't got a brain, but I think I have to worry. I haven't got a heart, but I've got a palpitation. This forest is haunted. I don't like the situation. Why are you gonna stand around and let them fill us full of horror? I'd like to roar them down, but I think I've lost my roar. Hey, fellas, I'm out of here.
get hurt. Hey, they will be resourceful. Yes, sir. So we'd like you to keep your promise to us, sir. Not so fast, not so fast. I'll have to give the matter some time. Go away and come back tomorrow. You're not very great and powerful if you can't keep your promises. Well, looky here. They know tend to the little man. The great Oz has spoken. Who are you? I am the great and powerful Wizard of Oz. You are? I don't believe you. Indeed I am. There's no other wizard but me. You humbug! You are a very bad man. No, my friend, I'm a very good man. I'm just a very bad wizard. What about the heart you promised Tin Man and the courage you promised Lion? And Scarecrow's brain? Back where I come from, we have universities where people go to become great thinkers. But they do have one thing you have got, a diploma. So I hereby grant you the honorary degree of THD. THD? A doctor of thinkology. Oh, joy! Oh, rapture! I've got a brain! How can I make you enough? Well, you can. <laughs> as for you, as for you, my friend, that guy I come from, we have men called heroes. They have no more courage than you. Um, but they do have one thing you haven't got, a medal. For extraordinary valor, I award you the triple cross. Ah, oh, yucks! I'm speechless. <laughs> As for you, my galvanized friend, I will never be practical until they can be made unbreakable. But I still want one. Back where I come from, we have people that do nothing all day but good deeds. They are called good deed doers. <laughs> so, uh, they, so for your kindness, here they took it of our affection. Oh, look, it ticks, it ticks. Read what my medal says. Courage, ain't it the truth, ain't it the truth? But what about Dorothy? Oh, I don't think there's anything in that black bag for me. You forced me into a cataclysmic decision. The only way to get you back to Kansas is is if I take you there myself. Oh, would you, could you? But are you a clever enough wizard to manage it? Child, you've cut me through the quick. I'm an old Kansas man myself, balloonist first class. <laughs> I, your wizard, am about to embark on a hazardous journey. I decree that until I return, the, the scarecrow, lion, and tin man will rule in my place. Toto, Toto, come back. Oh, please wait. I can't. I don't know how it works. Goodbye, folks. Goodbye. Goodbye. Now I'll never get home. Then stay with us, Dorothy. We don't want you to go. Look, here's someone who can help you. You don't need help any longer. You always have the power to go home. I have? Then why didn't you tell her before? She wouldn't have believed me. She had to figure it out for herself. What'd you learn, Dorothy? Well, I think it was enough, just wanting to see Uncle Henry and Auntie M. And it's that if I ever go searching for my heart's desire again, I won't look any further than my own backyard because if it isn't there, then I never really lost it to begin with. Is that right? That's all it is. Now close your eyes. Now, and those ruby slippers will take you home in two seconds. And Toto too? And Toto too. Well, it's hard to say goodbye. I love all of you. Goodbye, Tin Man. Oh, don't cry. You'll rust. Now I know I have a heart, because it's breaking. Goodbye, Lion. I'll miss what you used to holler before you found your courage. Shucks, Dorothy. I never would have found it if it wasn't for you. Oh, Scarecrow, I'm going to miss you so. Are you ready? Now close your eyes and click your heels, and think to yourself, there's no place like home. 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 Wake up, honey. Oh, and here I miss you. You get quite scared, child. For a while, we thought you were going to leave us. But I did leave you, Uncle Henry. That's the trouble. I've been trying to get back for days and days now. There, there. You're still now. You just had a bad dream. Gosh, Dorothy, it's Hickory. I'm so glad to see you. And 
still, all I kept saying was I want to go home. And here I am. <laughs> Doesn't anyone believe me? Of course we believe you, Dorothy. Oh, Toto, we're home. And you're all here, and I love you all. Oh, and TM, there's no place like home. <laughs> Thank you all. Thank you so much. Support the arts. Theater.